What's up you guys, Eddie Fliptronics. I'm going to be helping you guys out if you're having an issue with your iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus not being able to download apps. So the first thing you want to figure out, you guys, is if this is a Wi-Fi issue or if the app itself is, um, you know, just having an issue. So try installing another app to see if that's the issue. Um, otherwise, it could just be uh, a particular app not being able to finish installing. So uh, if you guys are trying to install a certain app and it's kind of, you know, stuck on waiting or something like that, just hold down on the app, uh, delete it, then try to reinstall it. Um, another thing you guys could try to do is uh, just double tap the home button and then close out the um, app store if you have the app store open. Sometimes doing that works as well. Try restarting your iPhone, you guys. That does work pretty well too if you're having any kind of overheating issue with your iPhone being on too long. Um, you could also uh, try um, refreshing your Wi-Fi network. So, uh, you know, you could um, reset the network settings on your Wi-Fi which is kind of a pain because you have to put the info back in, but it does work pretty well when you're having an issue with apps. So you could try, you know, resetting the network settings and, uh, you know, restarting your iPhone and, you know, uh, just putting the password back in. Uh, you could also try downloading the app through iTunes. Anytime that I'm having an issue downloading an app through Wi-Fi, uh, I'll try to do it through iTunes, um, you know, through a PC or Mac, and that works pretty well too. Uh, and then, um, you know, you could just try uh, looking for an iOS update. If you're due for an iOS update, that'll fix any bugs or glitches. And then, you know, like I pretty much said in the beginning of this video, um, try to figure out if the app you're trying to install is having an issue. So try downloading a, a couple apps to see if one of them, you know, works and the other one doesn't. It could just be an issue with that particular app. You know, sometimes certain apps in the App Store do not work correctly. So, that could be the issue, and if that is the issue, just try doing it through iTunes, like I said, on a PC or Mac. Anyways, you guys, those are my tips. I will leave them in the description. I would totally appreciate if you guys liked this video, shared it. As always, stay tuned for more, and be sure to subscribe to our channel.